Good evening, everybody. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here, not least because I get to recognize our youngest honoree, an advocate who is making waves across the country, Cody McDavis, a basketball player, a Division I athlete who had one eye on law school. Cody took an interest in NCAA's peculiar rule book. This is a rule book with entire sections on envelope sizes and souvenirs. But nowhere in that rule book is there any restriction on players who've been convicted of sexual assault. Cody decided to do something about this, and he made it his mission to get the NCAA to take gender-based violence seriously, banning student athletes with a history of abuse. He's convinced that changing the rules will change the culture, and he's partnered with activist and survivor Brenda Tracy to get colleges around the country to adopt sexual violence prevention policies. And so far, he's convinced the Big Sky Conference to become the first to ban players convicted of violence. But he won't be satisfied until the entire institution follows suit. His petition to the NCAA has almost 220,000 signatures, and I hope after tonight there'll be several more. He's a recent law school graduate and now a hardworking lawyer, but he's also had time to start his own foundation, Foundation 42, a nonprofit that offers scholarships to students who want to work in gender-based violence prevention and policy. So it is my great honor, on behalf of Vital Voices, to present the Solidarity Award to Cody McDavis.